I wanted to create a super simple Christmas makeup look that was easy for anybody to do that you could use for any Christmas or holiday parties that were coming up. I know it's only November, but I always get ahead of myself and get super excited for the holidays, so I wanted to get started on my holiday Christmas looks. I'm gonna do a couple of them. So this one is pretty simple to do, and anybody can do it. I hope you guys like this video. Let's get started. To prime, I'm gonna use the Kat Von D Locket Primer. For my foundation, I'm gonna use the Estee Lauder Double Wear Stay In Place Makeup, and I am the shade 2CO, um, Cool Vanilla. It looks really light on the camera, but when I go ahead and blend it all in, it works. So I'm gonna blend that in with my Flat Kabuki F80 Sigma brush. I seriously love this foundation so much. It doesn't budge during the whole entire day and I never have to powder. It's good for like a really long day. Hmm, I kind of look like a ghost. That's okay. So for my concealer, I'm gonna use the Tarte Shape Tape in Fair Beige. Now I'm going to go in with my airbrush concealer brush from Sephora and I'm just going to buff that out under the eye. I seriously can't film any videos without Fran jumping on me. She's obsessed. The lighting looks really weird. This is not working. Okay, I don't know if this lighting is better or not, but I just fooled around for about 10 minutes trying to get the lighting better. Um, I hope it works. Where was I? Ah, yes. Okay, time for some Lori, Lori, <laughs> Laura Mercy <laughs> powder. I'm just gonna put a little bit of that under my eye with my Real Technique sponge, and it is damp. Okay, and I'm gonna take the remaining of what's left in the lid and just set the rest of my face with it. Throw my sandwich away. My sandwich. My sandwich. I know it's only November, but as soon as Halloween was over, I was like, oh my god, I have to do a Christmas makeup look. So for the eye, I'm going to use this MAC Pro Longwear Paint Pot, and it's in the color Soft Orker. I have no idea how to pronounce this. I don't know. So I'm going to just put this all over the lid with just a concealer brush. Just so that my lid is like one color and you don't see gross weird veins. This is going to be a pretty simple eye look because I am going to do a red lip. So I don't want to go overboard with the eyeshadow. So to set the MAC paint pot on my lid, I'm going to go in with this pure eyeshadow palette that I got from Shoppers Drug Mart. It's so nice. I'm going to go in and I'm going to take a uh, color Private Party. And I'm just going to put that all over my lid. With this same palette, I'm going to go in with the color Gala. And I'm going to use that as a crease color with a really light hand and windshield and swirling motions. This brush is a Morphe brush. It's M518. I love this brush. I just want to darken my crease up a little bit, so I'm going to take the color Splurge. 
that's in the same palette. And I'm just gonna go in and work it into the crease and the outer corner of my eye. Just to mix the colors good together, I'm gonna go in back with Gala, my crease shade. And just blend the colors together. Hi, Franny. Hi, baby. Good momento. So that's it for the eyeshadow. I'm gonna go in and create a liquid cat eye using liquid liner from e.l.f. Bear with me, this takes a while. Oi. I really like that liner. I usually have a really hard time um, creating a cat wing liner and it worked pretty good. I like the tip on it and it honestly, it was $3. It's very precise and it's good. So lash time, I'm gonna curl my lashes. And I'm going to go in with this L'Oreal mascara. It's kind of chunky. It's okay, I'm putting lashes on top. Does anybody else make those faces when they're putting on mascara? For the lashes, I'm actually going to use one of my favorites. It's a uh, By Face by Megan and it's in Classic. Okay, look at the difference that it does. I feel like it makes my eyes look bigger. So this is the cute little case that it comes in my lash helm that I put it in. I'm just going to look up on my phone. I forget what her Instagram is for ordering these lashes. Oh, it's um, Shop Face by Megan. I don't know if you can even see that. For under the eye, I'm going to keep it pretty simple and I'm going to go in with Splurge again with just a blending brush and just blend it under my eye. And a little bit of mascara for my bottom lashes. Okay, time to bronze my face up because I keep looking at myself in the camera and I am a ghost. Just gonna use some Hoola bronzer, of course. Just bronze lightly around the forehead. For contour, I'm actually going to use a blush, which sounds so weird, but it is taupe and it's from MAC. I have used it a couple times for bronzing, just carving out my cheekbones. So I'm just going to take my Pro Contour brush 
and just carve out the cheekbones. For the blush, I'm gonna go in and use Milani, and this is in the color Romantic Rose. How pretty is this? I got this at, um, uh, what's it called? Superstore. I haven't used this yet. I just got it today, but it looked so pretty. And it was like six, seven dollars. Mm. It kind of smells like, you know, when you were a kid and you would get makeup for like presents and stuff and it was like play makeup. It kind of smells like that. But it's super pretty. For my highlight, I'm going to go in with this MAC Double Gleam Extra Dimension Skin Finish. It is gorgeous. Ooh. And I'm going to take my Pro Highlight Brush from Sephora and just go on the top of my cheek bone. Gives your skin a nice glow. Oh my god, look at my nose. <laughs> Need to tone that down a bit. Ooh. This is pretty intense on the camera, it looks like. I'm going to put some of this in the inner corner of my eye. For the lips, of course, I'm doing red. And this is Too Faced Melted Matte. And it is the color Lady Balls. Okay, so this completes the look. It was super simple to create, but yet it's very classy looking, and I hope you guys can use it for any Christmas or holiday parties that are coming up in the next couple months. So don't forget to subscribe to my channel, and I'll see you guys soon. Bye.